After I quit my job in 2019, I was hungry to find my life's purpose. I felt a void, a vacuum in my life. I thought I wasn't making a difference. I thought unless and until I find my purpose or my ikigai, I wouldn't be able to make an impact in the world. I was after finding a singular mission. I did plan to come to Rishikesh in 2019 to attend a satsang and to see gurus for some of these answers. I was convinced there was a goal in my life and I had to find it. I always wondered whether the animals or trees have these questions. I backpacked in the hostels and talked about the purpose of life with other hippies. I was going to volunteer at the Bali Spirit Festival. I read Krishna Murthy and the Stoics. Listen to endless self-help podcasts. I even joined a chanting group. After spending months to find my purpose, I realized I had entered another trap. This time a psychological one. I know it's a hard pill to swallow, but if rat race is a trap, so is finding your purpose. But this video set me free. What is the goal of life and how can it be achieved? My whole life I have been telling you <laughs> there is no goal Life has no purpose and meaning life is its own purpose there is no secret to be found there is no singular mission I have come to a conclusion that you don't find your purpose or meaning in life but you create it by following your curiosities starting something and failing at it by actively engaging with life or pursuing your personal growth Viktor Frankl said the meaning of life is to give life meaning for some it could mean creative pursuits or pursuing personal growth or self improvement For others it could mean relationships and connections being of service to others solving problems and doing something hard also gives my life meaning life has no goals there is no particular end but i have set my own goals apart from my professional goals i have decided to set the foundation to have a fulfilling life on three pillars cultivating a calm mind through self awareness a fit body through healthy habits and a house full of love based on trust commitment and communication these are inspired by a quote by navel ravikant which i find true a fit body a calm mind a house full of love these things cannot be bought they must be earned i would also add genuine friendships to the list pursuit of these four things adds a deeper meaning to my life it's a journey of earning life's most precious gifts thank you for watching let me know in comments below what adds meaning to your life if you liked watching this video you might want to watch this one